I don't expect any big issues through the Metroplex. Where you could run into the issues would be off just past the Metroplex east and southeast, back around Canton, back around uh, Corsicana, where we've had some heavier rain. The big picture, you can see this is a wide area being impacted. Uh, really, the core of this storm actually back around the panhandle. So this is the front edge, this big push of rain. We're just now on the front edge of this storm system. Widespread showers, occasionally some heavier pockets of rain in the mix, as we were talking about, back around Coffee. Headed towards uh, Mineola through Canton right now, some heavier pockets of rain. And then down around Ellis County, we have had some moderate to heavy rain as well. As we zoom in around the Metroplex, just some light showers for the most part. Collin County, Dallas County, it's pretty light for you, except a little bit heavier back around, uh, probably around the airport there, DFW Airport, and then back around uh, northern portions of Tarrant County, North Richland Hills, getting in on some moderate showers. Down to the south, moderate showers. Showers continue for Hillsborough as well. So that's all going to continue to move off to the east. Now, again, this is the, the bulk of the rain, and it's moving on throughout the morning period. Late morning, we're seeing all of that passes to the east. But I want you to notice we're not fully done. While we'll catch a bit of a lull from the major rain, we will have to watch because the cold front doesn't arrive until late afternoon. As that happens, 3, 4 o'clock, we could see additional scattered activity. So I would say from 3 till about 8, 9 o'clock, we still have to monitor the chance for some additional scattered showers and storms, but that would not be nearly as widespread. Once we push on into tomorrow morning, while we're left with some heavier clouds, we will see some dry weather develop. It's going to be much cooler for us on Wednesday, and we'll take that cooler forecast into Thursday as well. Taking a look right now from Dallas, it's nice to have a view. View. Remember yesterday we had no view for hours through the morning period. Visibility six miles will take it. Temperature right now 55 degrees, so kind of just hanging steady with some cool numbers, but not bad. When you consider this time in the year, we should actually be starting off in the 30s, yet we're starting off at 52 for McKinney, 53 right now for Denton. Through the remainder of the day, keep the rain jacket with you. It's a mild day before the cold front arrives. We'll get to about 58 by noon, and then our highs today pushing around 60 degrees. Again, a slight chance for some additional scattered showers as we roll on late afternoon and into tonight. But then the middle of the week, not bad, just turning cooler on Wednesday. Highs near 50. Yeah,